Good morning, and welcome to the first day of the 2014 Mid-America Truck Show. I'm Tim Myers, the president of Alcoa Wheel and Transportation Products, and I've got to tell you, I'm absolutely thrilled to be here today to tell you, on behalf of Alcoa, to tell you our latest news. We're about to show you what we believe is a revolutionary breakthrough for the heavy-duty truck industry. It's the kind of innovation that has defined our company for more than 125 years. Our metal and manufacturing expertise have been behind many critical breakthroughs in industries from aerospace and automotive to building and construction and, of course, heavy-duty trucks. Alcoa began advancing the commercial transportation industry in 1948 when we forged the first aluminum heavy-duty truck wheel a lighter, more durable, and lower maintenance offering than our competition, the steel wheel industry. Since then, Alcoa has brought many firsts to the commercial vehicle industry, and I know a lot of you know us well, so you've seen a few of these. In the 1970s, we actually brought the first aluminum wide base wheel to the heavy duty trucking industry. And in 2001, we followed that up with our 14-inch uh, wide base wheel product line. In 1980, we brought the uh, first forged aluminum hub-piloted heavy-duty truck wheel to the market. In 2001, we brought our revolutionary Durabrite product line to the market, a surface treatment designed to keep the wheel bright and shiny with just mild soap and water. And we're now on our third generation of that Durabright product line, which was introduced in Europe uh, last fall. And in 2005, we were the first to offer rim flange wear protection with our proprietary Durabright treatment. Alcoa continues to be the leader in lightweighting. Over the last 10 years of innovation, we have reduced the weight of our flagship <clears throat> 22 and a half by eight and a quarter inch wheel by over 10 pounds while increasing both its strength and its load rating at the same time. That's what I call progress. And in 2009, Alcoa launched the ind industry's lightest 22 and a half inch wheel ever at just 45 pounds by utilizing our proprietary level one technology to further strengthen and lightweight our wheels. We then went on a roll taking level one technology into nearly our entire wheel portfolio. Lightweighting aluminum wheels is our passion because we know that a lighter wheel leads to greater productivity for the fleet through increased payload, improved fuel efficiency, and enhanced sustainability. And now we know we can drive our wheel weight even lower. Our customers have come to expect the best from Alcoa and we gladly accept the challenge of maintaining our leadership position and developing the greatest looking, best performing commercial vehicle wheels in our industry. So I know some of you were at TMC. You know, TMC was just a few weeks ago. Alcoa showcased there how we took our level one technology and launched two more new wheel products, making Alcoa's level one 14 inch wide base wheels and nine inch wheels Again, the lightest in the industry. So I'll call your attention to the 14-inch wheel uh, to my right. Uh, that's Alcoa's latest offering at just 54 pounds. It's now four pounds lighter than the prior generation. The weight loss means that over the last 14 years, Alcoa's 14-inch wide base wheels have lost approximately 25% of their weight. With a load rating of 12,800 pounds, Alcoa's 14-inch wide base wheels are still the lightest in their class. In fact, converting from steel, wheel, steel dual wheels and tires to Alcoa 14-inch wheels and tires saves over 1,400 pounds per tractor and trailer combination. And right next to it, you can see on the far right there, our uh, new 15 uh, nine inch offering, 22 and a half by nine inch wheels. Came out with two fitments, one at 51 pounds, the other at 59 pounds. <clears throat> That's three pounds lighter than anything else available in their class, respectively, and more than 50 pounds lighter than a comparable steel wheel. 
Alcoa's advanced level one technology reduces wheel weight to improve profitability without sacrificing load rating. With a load rating of 10,000 pounds, these are heavy load wheels, ideal for refuse collection, logging, mining, and other heavy haul applications. Advancements within our current pro product portfolio continue to showcase Alcoa's capability to increase payload and lower operating costs for all of our customers. But in addition to the new wheels, Last year, Alcoa launched our newest alloy, the patent-pending 6361 alloy known as MagnaForce. This is the first new aluminum, truck, aluminum alloy for truck wheels in 45 years since our introduction of 6061 in 1968. Our scientists and engineers at the Alcoa Technical Center, the largest light metals R&D center in the world, invented this alloy following more than two years of development. As you will soon see, MagnaForce is the alloy that will change the future of forged aluminum wheels. MagnaForce maintains the same corrosion resistant characteristics of 6061, yet it increases its strength and durability, resulting in lighter weight wheels. In fact, extensive laboratory and field testing have proven that MagnaForce is on average 17% stronger than the current industry standard 6061 in similar applications. So, now the moment we've all been waiting for. You absolutely won't believe what's coming next. Today, Alcoa is launching its latest innovation. In a world where every pound counts, one company is delivering innovation that shines above the rest. Coming spring 2014, the commercial vehicle wheel reinvented again. You won't believe what's coming next. It's my pleasure to introduce Alcoa's revolutionary Ultra One wheel with the MagnaForce alloy. All right, there it is, at 40 pounds. That's right, I said at 40 pounds, 40 pounds of pure muscle. This is the lightest aluminum forged wheel in the trucking industry in the world, which of course makes it the lightest weight aluminum wheel in the trucking industry in the world. It maintains all the features and benefits of our current wheels. They're just unbelievably lighter and remarkably stronger. These, little, these wheels are literally heavy duty without the heavy. Ultra One incorporates the strength of the MagnaForce alloy resulting in the lightest wheel in the industry, increasing payload, reducing fuel consumption, and the associated greenhouse gas emissions, as well as lowering operating costs for our customers. No one else has Alcoa's mix of manufacturing, design, technology, and light metals expertise to engineer a magnitude of this break, a breakthrough of this magnitude. Eliminating five pounds from our previous wheel, which was already the lightest in the world. This is the largest single weight reduction ever offered to our valued customers. The world's lightest commercial truck wheel to improve their freight efficiency and lower their operating costs. Ultra One will be introduced to the, in the industry standard 22 and a half by eight and a quarter inch size application. With this weight reduction, fleets can expect to save nearly 100 pounds per 18 wheeler, building on the smart decision they already made 
when they switched from steel to our existing aluminum products. Another groundbreaking milestone for forged aluminum truck wheels. To ensure fleets and OEMs can easily specify Ultra One, the wheels will be identified using the product code Ultra, followed by the finish option. Alcoa is already selling early production Ultra One wheels with MagnaForce Alloy to select customers, and this exciting new wheel is now available to all OEM customers. In fact, key customers like TMC Transportation, one of America's largest flatbed carriers, have already selected Ultra One as their standard specification on trucks and trailers. We thank them for their partnership and their leadership in our industry. Innovation has always been a part of our DNA, and this launch of Ultra One once again demonstrates our commitment to product innovation since our founding over 125 years ago. We invite you to get a closer look at the Alcoa Ultra One wheels with the MagnaForce alloy right here in our booth, as well as across the Mid-America truck show floor as Ultra One production wheels are displayed by many of our partners. We also have USB press kits with full release and image materials covering in detail this exciting launch. Please see Brian Thomas or pick up your press kit here. At this time, I'd welcome any questions you may have. Yes? <laughs> How much are they going to cost? Well, um, the, the products are going to be priced uh, similar to the existing uh, 22 and a half inch wheel. There will be a slight premium for them. Uh, obviously, we're creating more value for uh, our customers, and we'll be sharing that with the industry. Yes? Like an, yes, do you have a more exact cost, a number estimation? <laughs> I think that, that uh, that's going to be determined between ourselves and our customers as we bring the product to market. Others? Any other questions? Yes? Will it be uh, available in 14 inch wide? So our intention, just as you saw, we launched level one on the uh, 22 and 8 and a quarter inch wheel in 2009, and then we continued to progress that technology through our entire product portfolio. So we will be taking that through and lightweighting our wide base wheels and all of our other applications. There's a series of product launches that will follow this one over the next uh, couple of years. Good questions. Any others? We have one right here. You're assuming it will replace or? Will, will it replace your current lightest wheels over time then? Yeah, I think, you know, our belief is that this will eventually be the standard wheel in our lineup because the reason our customers migrate to aluminum wheels is for the weight savings. So as this uh, product rolls out into the marketplace, it will naturally replace the old level one uh, wheel, the 45 pound wheel. Yes, thank you. Yes, sir. Went into this. How much development or research went into this uh, new Ultra One? Yeah, so this was a very um, accelerated development program for us. We actually had a, uh, a team that included people from our wheel division as well as Alcoa Technical Center. Uh, it took us approximately two years to uh, bring all the technologies together, uh, down select on the new material as well as what that could do for our design and uh, get the first uh, actual wheels sellable wheels into the marketplace. 24 months. That's great. Yes, sir. Just to clarify, how many fleet customers do you have for this product right now? Just TMC? No, 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 no. We've been, uh, we actually had a soft launch. It was pretty well coordinated when we introduced the new alloy. Uh, we had several fleets at that time that were already running on the, uh, on the new Ultra One wheel. You know, one, obviously, we do a lot of development work in the lab, 
uh, but we want to make sure that we can validate that with, with lots of road miles before we have a major launch like this. So Todd, you're in the back. Would it be safe to say a uh, dozen? Yeah, it's safe to say we have dozens of fleets that, that have shown an interest and many fleets have purchased Ultra One wheels already. Got another question. Um, how many miles did you run this to validate it? So we had well over a million road miles by the time uh, we've, we've gotten here. It's probably closer to two million road miles. Um, but you know, the, the, primary, the primary development uh, criteria for wheels are in fatigue life. And so we had you know, dozens and dozens of wheels that went through and passed the standards that we've established for these wheels uh, to know that they were going to hold up in the field and then we take them out and actually get some feedback from the fleets. Now, will these be like the Durbright, or you still have to get them buffed out? So um, these, these wheels are the base wheel. They're, in, they're available in all of our finishes. So if a customer wants to get the, the seven finish, which is the two-sided bright finish on, untreated, that's available. Um, if they want to get it Durabrighted on either side or both sides, that, that's also available. The alloy, even though it's new, the, um, the aesthetics, the brightness levels and everything are basically the same as 6061. So they can convert on existing equipment and it'll still marry up with the wheels they bought from us in the past. Thank you. Other questions? I want to chop anyone off. Okay, well thank you very much for the interest. Uh, as you can tell, we're very, very excited about it and I'll certainly be around the booth here for a few hours if any of you had follow-up questions. Have a good morning.